Well, hey, y'all. It's Debbie, your girl with pearls. And today I'm sharing my cozy winter home decor. I used the snowflake theme. Now, I love snow and snowflakes as long as I don't live in it. Snowflakes that stay on my nose and eyelashes. I just love that little song. So that's kind of my theme. I kept winter up for the month of January. So I have a lot of flocking going on. And I changed out my village from Christmas. I just left it snowy looking. Took down all the Christmas stuff that was around it. And that just looks so pretty at night. I left my drippy snow and my snowball garland that I made. That was a DIY. And then in my terrarium, I did a cute little snow village. With some snowballs and some bottle brush trees and one of the houses. And that's a white boa in there with some angel lights and then some crusty icy looking picks this cute little let it snow lantern it's just so cozy looking and of course on the TV I put on a cute wintry scene you can see my um, mantle is decked out with the evergreen and snowflakes and snowballs and I have fairy lights I love those lights at night it's just so cozy I have snowballs all mixed in and encrusted pieces and picks perfect for January some pine cones and beads with snowflakes and cute little snowmen. And I left out some trees, my snowflake placemats. At night, y'all, it gives me all that cozy vibe that I love. Because, you know, it gets dark at 5 o'clock, so. <laughs> this makes me smile. It makes me happy. Look at those cute snowballs. My snowflakes. This is the centerpiece on my kitchen table. And as I said in my previous video, I stripped all my trees and just left the white lights on them. Now I did my tiered tray over, and you're gonna see two versions of it because I did it once and I liked it, but I'm the kind of person that looks at something for a bit and changes it up. So you're gonna see this version and then you'll see the second version. So that's the first version. And this is the second version. And that's the one I ended up keeping. I had that picture on the centerpiece on the table and that picture was just bothering me because it was blocking the houses. Um, so I decided to put it on the tiered tray. It's no much fun. And of course I left my cocoa bar up for the month of January and I enjoy that every night. 
And you can see I took away all the Christmassy things, if you saw my Christmas cocoa bar, and I used the snowflake placemats. Um, and I used the bottle brush trees, more um, greens I brought in. Removed all the candy and so forth that I had um, on my Christmas one. It's still so adorable. I just love it. And the sled right there, perfect for snow. And then this is a cute little sign. I picked this up at the Target dollar spot. Silver white winters that melt into spring. Then over by the coffee maker, I got my cream and sugar. And I set up a cute little vignette there. I did change out the house because the other one was too short and squatty, so I went for a taller one. And I kept my counters very clean this um, season because I have so much going on everywhere else. Now that um, box um, I had on the dining room table for Christmas, and if you want to go back and look at it, you'll see I had buffalo plaid trees in there with the galvanized trees. But what I did here is I used the um, twig one that's got the white flocking on it. And then I added the snowballs and I removed all the red picks. Now this is my formal living room. And I left that tree stripped down just the white lights. And of course I removed all the Christmas and put some green back into the room. But look at all the trees lit. How beautiful does that look? It's just so cozy. I do love the white lights in January. And my silk white point setters. I think they look so pretty. Well, if you enjoy videos like this, I hope you'll subscribe. I do a lot of DIYs, decorating, crafting, and cooking. If you haven't yet subscribed to Your Girl with Pearls, I hope you'll consider it. And if you hit the notification bell every time I upload a video, they'll let you know. Hey friends, thanks so much for watching. I wish you a blessed 2020.